Happy holidays, everybody. It's your buddy, Jacob Horse. I'm here to tell you about all the amazing merchandise we have on sale for you this holiday season. <laughs> we have a delete your art beanie, a draw feet tote bag. Look at that, Jacob Horse pin. It features me, Jacob Horse. Oh, look, a Jacob Horse shirt. Wow, that's great. We also have restocks on old items, and it's all available in the Drawfee merch store link in description. <sighs> Welcome to Drawfee, where we take your dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Jacob. I'm Nathan. And I'm Karina. And today's suggestion comes to us from essentially the opposite of a Patreon supporter. <laughs> Patreon detractor. The person that we pay to do work for us, George, Whoa. <laughs> uh, suggested to us that we do local paper headlines. Thanks for being a George. As Thanks drawings, George. George is the only George. <laughs> And and thank you, George. Yeah, if you think your name's George, incorrect. <laughs> Check so again. Sorry. <laughs> hate to you be have the been lied to. to. <laughs> Look at your ID. It's Jorb now. Jorb. <laughs> <laughs> Breaking news. All Georges are Jorbs except yeah. one. Whoa. And it's not spelled the way that you think it is. <laughs> Well, like I said, but I'll say it again because I think it got lost in the sauce. Yeah, what? we're doing local newspaper headlines as drawing. So I found. What does it have to do with George? That's just it's just what he said. <laughs> no, George said that. Oh, sorry, I get them confused. <laughs> I get my George and my Jorb confused. My Jorb. So I picked three newspaper headlines I found on the internet, that, and I, I specifically picked ones I thought were kind of like cryptic and vague. Yeah. <laughs> So we'd have a lot of room to go hog wild on them. Oh, it's a hog wild episode. Um, Nathan, oh, you're gonna go first. Going hog I'm an, wild I'm for gonna, George. I'm gonna, 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 I'm gonna give you a random number from one to three, and that's Ooh. gonna determine your prompt. I'm excited. Negative two. <laughs> that's not. <laughs> that's not right. Stop fucking around. <laughs> Uh oh. <laughs> Let's try again. Uh oh. <laughs> Yours is number three. Okay. <laughs> the owls are not what they seem. <laughs> Animal watch. No way. I was just doing a capture where it told me to identify owls. Were they not owls? Maybe they weren't. They seemed like owls, seemed but I don't like know owls. if they were. <laughs> Is that why they made me cry and piss a little? Are not what they <laughs> Imagine opening your newspaper and reading that headline. I would like have a meltdown. Yeah. All right. Let's get some owls. Like, well, they seem like owls. They seem like owls, but yeah, I guess what they're. What are you trying to tell me? Owls are not what they seem. And I don't have further context. Either, oh, you so... don't. We don't actually know what the. This is, this is the what article we get. Says, I mean, I can like try we're to never find gonna, it. Okay. Well, I know that owls, when you like hike up their feathers, their their legs look crazy. Yeah, they're they're like little gray aliens that they, happen to be birds. They seem like cute little birds, but they're they're not. So we know <laughs> that already. But these owls, they're not what they seem. So apparently, it's a thing that someone says in Twin Peaks. Okay. At some point, so it's a it's a reference. They're making okay, like a funny, a funny. They're making a funny reference, reference to mm. twin. So any Twin Peaks fans out there um, loved that. Loved that. And, and any and normal <laughs> person. <laughs> are you a Twin Peaks fan or are you normal? <laughs> <laughs> So if if you're like a fan of like the the triple peaks or just a singular peak, uh huh, then maybe this one wasn't for you. No, just the twins. Just the twins. Just the twins. Because in the discussion leading up to this suggestion being made by George, our beloved George, not Jorb, not Jorb, that's the rest of you. Yeah, sorry. It's because Julia was reading a local newspaper and. We were all very charmed by it. Yes, exactly. And as I put it, 
Local newspapers feel like one big inside joke. Yeah. Yeah, they do. <laughs> I thought about like putting that one in the episode, but then I was like, but I don't want to reveal where yeah. we live. Yeah. Which is <laughs> inadvertently the correct and smart thing to do. I've doxed myself enough times. Yeah. yeah. Enough. <laughs> enough. <laughs> I'm, I'm done. I'm not doing it anymore. <laughs> Someone else can dox themselves next time. Mm, not it. Oh, Nathan. <laughs> guess it's me. You got to dox yourself. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry to me. <laughs> you're you're going to have to tell everyone that you live in Columbus, Ohio. Uh-oh. The secret come out. Yeah. On Columbus Street. P P Pageant Avenue. On Pageant Avenue. The way your face <laughs> was just grasping for the B sound and then it didn't come out. Uh, I'm gonna be thinking about this for the rest of the day. What was he to. what was he gonna say? <laughs> I was doing that thing. Sometimes I just like start saying a sound and I have like full faith that my brain is gonna supply me with like an end to the word. I don't think that's the energy we're bringing today. And today it let me down 100%. Yeah. <laughs> you were going for the sound and it's like, nah. -uh. Yeah, it's choose like, another. Try a different one. Yeah, that that one. You're not even gonna get it. <laughs> yeah, try a different but similar sound. You look we'll like you were you about a... to cry. <laughs> I feel like I'm about to cry. <laughs> it's because the owl <laughs> is not what it seems. Yeah. I don't know what it is. It's like, not, there it's, it is. It's not what it seems. Nathan, that seems like an owl. Yeah, yeah I'll tell you, you that much. Yeah, you just drew a cute owl. Well, yeah. So and so what, what is it? Well, What's its secret? I, what's its owl secret? I was hoping I'd come up with something. <laughs> oh, so you were also doing, <laughs> yeah, you a, were doing... <laughs> a brain gamble like I was. Here, let's do, let's, let's, uh, Julia's not here, so I can sort of, Steal her, sort of <laughs> steal her drip, steal her drip a little. Wow. Um, and let's just you know let's explore. If you make the head go up and separate it, yeah, we separate. Mm -hmm. Where does that leave us? What does this allow us to do? We've sort of got this. Um, Apply a lot of things. Yeah. There's also, <laughs> um, I just wanted to to let you all know. Mm -hmm. There's an article in the Atlantic called The Owls Are Not What They Seem. Okay. Is it also about Twin Peaks? It, no, I think it's about owls. It says the birds possess even uncannier powers than we've imagined. Powers? Yeah. Implying that they had powers to begin with? They've got uncanny. Well, we had imagined that they had powers. And but the... their powers are more uncanny than what we imagined. <laughs> we should just start, like... <laughs> normalizing having powers yeah just take the qualities we already have and just call them powers why not yeah they are powers now yeah. we have the power to make you go <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ah. yeah that's you that's, <laughs> that's you and <what> <laughs> watching us that's what you sound like yeah. jorb 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 <laughs> Giggling your little tushy off over there. Yeah. <laughs> well, you think I guess it's that's funny? your power to giggle. <laughs> it's one of your powers. Yeah. But you probably have even more uncannier powers than we even <laughs> Wait, imagined. what powers do owls have that we did not anticipate? I'm trying to like find that out in this article, but it's written like a damn short story. <laughs> It's like really like florid with its language. Oh my god! It's gonna be a fucking recipe for apple pie at the end of this article. <laughs> the article starts by saying, "In the moments before seeing an owl, comes a feeling like intuition." Yeah. What? I will not forget one night when I stood on a balcony in suburban Sydney, and every wakeful creature in the surrounding bushland abruptly froze, and so on. Huh? I want a listicle that says power one. <laughs> power that owls have. <laughs> power two. Super strength. Oh, so this is like a little freak in here. Yeah. Is this an owl? Yeah, I think this is. Oh, this is like one of those naked owls that you find in your attic and it makes you question everything. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. The little baby owls yeah, that, look, that like, look disgusting. Yeah, that look like weird, wet socks <laughs> yeah this is what happens when they grow up they get like an owl costume so they can blend in but they're but... still the same in there yeah yeah they're just you know <laughs> it's one of their powers <laughs> should i draw another one because it's owls multiple 
Yeah, go crazy. Okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. I just want you to know that according to this article, owls can lead us to doubt our own faculties while drawing us to wonder at the mysteries of theirs. They're always doing that. <laughs> Every time I see an <laughs> owl, I'm like, like is oh, this real? Am I actually experiencing this? My is, faculties. Is anything real? <laughs> my faculties are in are called into question <laughs> as I witness this owl. <laughs> this can't really be happening. <laughs> Someone help. <laughs> the owls are making me question again. <laughs> why, why did this person write this article? <laughs> <laughs> Slow news day. <laughs> Slow news day. <laughs> Gotta ponder the owls. Gotta ponder, yeah. Pondering orbs is over. Yeah, we're pondering owls now. Yeah. Put away your orbs and put an owl in front of you. Look at it and really think about your life. One of the descriptions in Jorb. here refers to an owl as a floppy goblin. <laughs> Is this the so same I, article? Yeah. Floppy goblin. That's I, sort of. I what think that's kind of where you're headed yeah. here. Yeah. I, I did sort of draw like floppy goblins. How did you? How did you guess? I think you've nailed it. All right. I, well, great. I got it right. Nathan, did you write this article in the future? Me, it was me from the future. <laughs> yeah, Nathan, Nathan was in Sydney when he yeah. heard the great horned owl for the first time. Yeah, and then saw it. And then questioned his faculties. <laughs> Every time I see an owl, I go, this can't be happening. <laughs> <laughs> and every time we kiss. Yes. Oh. Uh, <laughs> like an owl does at night. <laughs> That's the extended version of the song. Yeah. Every time we touch Taylor's version, 10 minute <laughs> <laughs> cut. I think Taylor Swift should just start redoing like other people's albums as yeah. Taylor's versions too. I like that. <laughs> you made this. I made this. <laughs> yeah. I want to listen to Carly Rae Jepsen's Emotion parentheses Taylor's, Taylor's <laughs> version. <laughs> <laughs> Where she like outsells Carly Rae Jepsen no! on her own, own album like 10 to 1. <laughs> and this is the person <laughs> who wrote that article. Questioning their faculty. <laughs> it's like, I thought they seemed like one thing, but now it looks like they're another thing. Yeah. I thought they were owls, but they actually are floppy goblins. <laughs> 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 floppy goblins. I like that descriptor. Yeah, that's good. I think owls are cool. Yeah. I just like to say it. Yeah, but they're not what they seem, and the truth has come out. And you can't you can't truth back in once it come out. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> You're so right. You dude. sure can. <laughs> you can't. I've tried. Nathan, I feel like this image is going to end up like on a different part of the internet on like a conspiracy board. Like, yeah, you know, this is a like... photograph that was ta it's like, yeah, well, explain this photograph of that of the floppy goblin owls. And yeah. someone's like, I I'm pretty sure that's a drawing no. from like a comedy like a silly drawing show. Yeah, they were hinting to us at the truth of things. Yeah. Well, gee, sounds like someone hasn't reassess their faculties yeah what check your faculties wording? dumbass <laughs> um check your faculties <laughs> fucking arm i drew so, i love it it's so stupid <laughs> he went <laughs> that's what your arm does when your whole faculties <laughs> yeah undermined Is he, you know an adult with the proportions of a baby <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> i think he is and these guys are like he's gonna go away soon right yeah, just, just lower the heads back on. He'll never he'll no, forget. No one will believe him. Yeah. This dude's faculties have been in question for so long. <laughs> They'll just laugh at him. They'll laugh at him like they always do. His arm's too small. <laughs> <laughs> His arm's too small and doesn't have bones. <laughs> so nobody respects him. <laughs> well... I, I think I, I think this is it. Yeah, I great think job. It is it. <laughs> These owls are not what they seem. You're no. completely 
yeah accurate on that <laughs> i don't think anything in this picture is what it seems <laughs> no i'm starting to feel like maybe that guy's an owl oh yeah maybe he's the real owl but maybe those are just my faculties yeah being rewired and messed up just 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 fucked up <laughs> just fucked i want to take my fucked up faculties and use it to draw a picture please wow do it thank you <laughs> do it then okay who wants to see what I've got cooking? I sure hope you roll a negative number. <laughs> negative <again>. two again. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I rolled positive two. Okay. Wow. Whoa. Are you positive? I'm positive, and the two is positive. Let's I'm, see what I got. I'm Damn. positive two. Thank you. <laughs> Who left <laughs> Tiny Farm by my car? <laughs> <laughs> that's a that's a great question that I ask myself at least once a day. <laughs> Left tiny farm by... Stop leaving tiny farm by my car. By my <laughs> car. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> okay, so let's get some perspective here. That's not how you do that on this. You do it this way. Oh, let's get this. We got a horizon line. Whoa. And then we can get like a like the wheel of the car. Yeah, because this is a tiny farm. Yeah. yeah. We're not going to get to see the whole car. No, that would be insane. Yeah. I will, you know, say to you now Me? that I cropped this image a bit. Okay. It actually did have a photo with it. Oh, of the tiny farm? And it, it was just a tiny farm next to a car. So Someone it was left. not, like, it was accurate. <laughs> I hate when that happens. I, like, get home from work, and I realize I left tiny farm just, like, in the parking lot. <laughs> it slipped out of my bag. <laughs> yeah. Well, this person left their tiny farm near the car of a local journalist. Whoa. And so now they're getting... They're getting put on blast. Doesn't get isekai. <laughs> <laughs> Careful. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Is, wow. Nice perspective. It's not quite right, but no, it's, it's good. It's, it's pretty good. It's good enough for this. It's better than <laughs> the arm I drew. Because <laughs> this is the car is not the the reason we're here. No, the car is simply for context. Yeah. yeah. We know why we're here. It's for Tiny it's Farm. It's for Tiny Farm. And we, uh, who do you think? I mean, I guess, Karina, did you leave it? Is what? this your yeah, Tiny you? Farm? Did you, did you do it? You think I would be so careless to just drop my Tiny Farm somewhere? Well, you just you, forget it. You just said that you, you do that sometimes. I was lying. Oh, <laughs> funny. Oh, oh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> I thought you were you don't understand I thought, my humor. I thought you were going on record as saying this was your <laughs> tiny farm. Everything I've ever said on this show is a lie. Wow. Find one truthful <laughs> statement I've ever made on the Drawfee show. You you can't. Yeah. All we do is lie. All we do is eat hot chip and lie. <laughs> Evergreen joke. <laughs> the kids love when we eat hot chip and lie. <laughs> I need more space. I got to get rid of that. I mean, the, the farm's got to be tiny, though, so you don't need too much space. The farm's going to be tiny. Yeah. All right? Okay? Yeah. Do you trust me on that? No. Yeah. We're just, there's things, you know, there's considerations that have <laughs> yeah. to be made. There's things in this world that you don't understand, like yeah. owls. Like owls and who left their tiny farm by my car. <laughs> New game show. <laughs> New improv game. Who left this tiny farm by my car? It's a lot, it's maybe too many words. And will you... Are you coming back for it? Will you... Are will you, you... Are you... Do come back... Come back. Come back. I miss you. I miss you. <laughs> Here's, this is a barn yeah. of sorts. That's a tiny barn. Why is it? And That's a good barn. Church doors. It's barn. Those are barn those doors. Those are barn doors. No. Have you ever seen a barn before? <laughs> yeah. Because I don't remember what one looks like off the top it of my head. It kind of looks like that. I can tell. <laughs> And then, of course, it's there's a like a fence. You put the fence. You put like the tiny grain silo. Oh yeah, the grain silo, of yeah. course, would be over here. Yeah. Where's the tiny scarecrow? 
Tiny Scarecrow. Yeah, we'll get that. This is a good one for Jacob. I like I like watching. Jo- oh no! Oh no! 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 Not like that. But it has to be. <laughs> I guess it. Yeah. What, how else would it be? I guess it's just that. How do you get the grain out of the silo? Is um, there like a door? There's an elevator, right? <laughs> the grain elevator. You just... <laughs> you just well for, a, a, for one that, that yeah for tiny, one that small <laughs> you just sort of pick it up and shake yeah. it like a like yeah. a salt shaker but for grain yeah and the grain comes out of the head and here's the pig oh this is a good tiny farm if someone left a tiny farm by my car I wouldn't tell anyone I would just enjoy it I'd keep it all to myself you're like wow for me. This is for me. It's for it's me. For I wouldn't question it, but that's that's why I, I don't have the inquisitive mind of a, a local journalist who's who's gonna <laughs> break the story no matter what. That's the sheep, of course. Of course. Of course. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> one one tiny pig, one tiny sheep. Uh, here's the farm land. But where's the horse, of course? The tilled soil. Oh yeah. The crops are not growing in yet. It's the wrong season. It's the wrong season. They just got planted. They just got dropped by the car. <laughs> this is such a precarious place to leave a, a tiny farm. Maybe there's like some, you know, fence over okay, here. Okay, that'll protect it. Okay, yeah. Yeah. To keep That's out. Good. That'll protect it. That'll out protect intruders. it from the wheels, the giant tires. Um, okay. Yeah. <laughs> How you doing, bud? Well, you know, I'm just, I got to get the horse. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So the horse will be here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's, that's it. Oh. Is there a cow? For a moment, I thought it was dead. No. Just kind of doing his thing over yeah. this way. Yeah. I thought that the ears were the legs. That's why. So the cow is over here a little far away. I like that none of the animals really want to have anything to do with each other. Yeah, I think they're all feuding. They're all just, they're all just doing their own thing. I mean, I guess when you're tiny... You can sort of make your own space. Yeah. You don't you don't take up that much space. Like that Mad Damon movie. Oh, downsizing. Where he gets really small. Yeah. Did, or... any, did anyone on Earth see that movie? I saw Was it called the downsizing? Trailer. It was called downsizing. Okay. Yeah. I saw the trailer for it and made a face because I grew up on DeviantArt and then actively tried to forget about it until someone brought it up. Who? I don't know. Some schmuck, I guess. I have a headcanon for that movie. <laughs> yeah. Where it's you like have fanfic for downsizing. Yeah, yeah, just sort, just sort of. It's it's it it's fanfic, fanfic I've never written, but my my idea is it's like the the first half of it is very just like this social commentary about making yourself small. Uh, you know, it's it's very satirical and and lighthearted, and then they get to the town. And then, like, some birds show up and it becomes like a survival horror movie. Oh, that would be amazing. <laughs> it's just like we didn't, we didn't consider birds. We forgot about we birds. We forgot about birds. Classic <laughs> mistake. We made this whole thing. We have the technology to make ourselves smaller, but we didn't think about birds. Just make the birds smaller. Whoa. <gasps> There's fanfic for it. Oh my God. I mean, yeah, tiny Matt Damon. There's gonna, there's gonna be some fan. <laughs> oh my god! So as you can see here, is this the reporter? Um, this is this is a very large farmer. Oh, that's the farm. That's his farm. This is his farm. So that's who left. Is he the one who left it? He's the one who left it. We caught on film. Okay, so he's is he coming back it? to How to big get is it? That car. This is a human sized car. This is an extremely oh, large. Oh, the farm. farmer is even bigger than a regular person. Yeah. <laughs> So the, his to him the tiny <laughs> farm is following. even tinier. He's sort of like a hobbyist. Oh, you know, he likes to make tiny farms. He's that, really big and he likes to make really small farms and leave them next to normal sized cars. That's not part of it either way. He's not. He's like so engrossed. Oh, he didn't even notice in what he's doing the the normal sized car. The, he like the normal sized car is incidental. Think of it this way. Okay, he was walking along. Yeah, and he saw this beautiful patch of dirt, next in the parking in lot. In the parking lot, yeah. And he was like, "Okay, that's this is the the exact spot we can put down roots here to make another tiny farm." 
So this is not his first tiny farm. No, he's a he's a lifetime hob tiny farm hobbyist. <laughs> yeah. The tiny animals are real though. Yeah. Did he engineer them himself or did he take regular sized animals and downsizing them? Well, we don't know. No one's ever ever spoken okay. to this to this guy. I is is the are we are we saying that this article like turns into an interview with this giant farmer? Like it really sort of buries the lead where it leads with the the tiny farm, but then partway through the article you realize that the the person being interviewed is is actually a giant man. Yeah, they lure you in with the tiny farm and the mystery, and then they hit you with the the real truth, which is that um just like a lot of conspiracy theorists thought giants are real. Giants are real. <laughs> Owls are goblins. Di- dinosaurs are fake. Giants are real. Giant men are real. And they they make tiny farms. Well, this, this one does, yeah. So it's sort of this guy's They thing. can do whatever they want. They're they, hiding in plain sight. The giant men. The giant men. They're all around us. Yeah. And, you know, big cor- corporate media isn't going to break the story, but your local paper, it just might. It just might. Well, the, the local paper didn't know what they were getting into. Yeah. You know? They're just reporting on what they saw. Yeah. And that's the beauty. They don't have the um, of local journalism. The spin, the twist, the torque, the torsion, the torsion, the twerk. Karina, you you got very quiet. Were you reading the <laughs> the fanfic? No, I was reading the Wikipedia article about downsizing the movie, and I was reading the plot summary. And it sounds very dark. Do birds show yeah, up? Yeah, do birds show up? No. Do owls show up? No. It just sounds like depressing oh <laughs> <laughs> it's not really like fun yeah they could have asked me i think i i bet they could have made it depressing and still put some birds in there you know <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of a wonder that they did it without adding the birds yeah you know that's that's what you get when you you write yeah. a whole movie without asking or like me first. raccoons oh yeah <laughs> Those would be terrifying too, because they've got hands. <laughs> they got hands. <laughs> they got hands. Who's this? This is the scarecrow. Oh, okay. <gasps> Currently being uh, placed down. Just use tweezers, you dumb old man. No, he has to do it by hand. This is like part of the the process that he enjoys. Yeah. Like he doesn't some, look like he's enjoying it. Some giant men use giant tweezers to make their tiny farms, but not me. Not me. I, I do everything by hand. I'm a purist. I've only <laughs> I've only crushed a couple scarecrows. <laughs> but, you, know, you learn. You learn the, the right amount of, of touch to do. The right amount of touch to do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. The right amount of touch to I do. I wasn't questioning it. <laughs> and then once you learn it, Every time you touch, you'll get the feeling. <laughs> <laughs> and then what? And then what? <laughs> what do you mean? That's it. That's it. <laughs> you just get the feel. Get the feeling. This is it. This yeah. was this, this was the it. answer to the mystery. So, yeah, the answer was the giant man who loves making tiny man. farms is, is, <laughs> who, is who left their tiny yeah. farm. Well, it doesn't look like he left it there. It looks like he's he's still there. Oh, when you added that line, it looks like the car is watching intently. What, this line? Yeah. This line? Yeah, yeah that's like, a mouth. The and the one going, above it oh. is the nose. But and then the this, rear, is, this rear. is behind. It can't be watching. Okay, it's just looking. It saw an owl. It saw, it saw <laughs> Like an over owl. there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's why I didn't notice this guy setting up the tiny farm. And it remained a mystery to this day. So we, and so we don't know what the article was about. No, because other the, than that, there was a tiny farm next to a car, is, but I don't uh, have the answer. Is that also a Twin Peaks reference? There's, I mean, I don't have. So any help it's, it's, me, does, does God! Someone, is every local news article just referencing, referencing Twin Peaks? <laughs> Twin Peaks. <laughs> Find a new bit. It's like entirely possible. I love it when Kyle McLaughlin gets out of his car and sees the tiny farm next to it in Twin Peaks. I'm going to fix this car's perspective in post. Don't worry about that. I think it's really nice. I think nice. it's good. I'm it's not... pretty jacked up. I mean, it's, it's not correct, no, but I still think correct. it's cool. People already saw the render for mine, so I'm just going to reiterate here that I did not fix the arm. No, <laughs> you I better wouldn't. not I made it. If anything, I made it worse. <laughs> I wouldn't want you to have done that. Okay, note, note to Nathan. Yeah. Make the arm worse. Make yeah. the arm worse. <laughs> Jacob, make the car better. Karina, 
What? It's your turn. It's your turn. Please report to the drawing station. Karina. What? There's one more left, and it's one. It's number one. Just like me. <laughs> Newest residents are from elsewhere. Whoa. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> <laughs> you don't say. They, wow. just, they just got here, but they they aren't from here. They had to come from somewhere else to yeah. get here. Mm. Yeah, that's a Twin Peaks reference for sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's just something that all like <laughs> writers do when they work for the local paper they're just like oh i'm gonna reference twin <laughs> Ooh, peaks boy in a way you'll never expect or <laughs> see coming and no one has ever done this before <laughs> this is gonna blow your whole shit out of your ass when you see this one <laughs> whoa your shit <laughs> it's everywhere now <laughs> That's right, Jorb. <laughs> You're going to soil your trousers. Yeah. Do you need some wet wipes, Jorb? <laughs> you need some new trousies? Because you look like you stink. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> this is nothing. <laughs> well, I thought it sounded kind of like creepy. Could yeah, be kind of creepy. Yeah, it's some like welcome to Night Vale ass. <laughs> yeah. Welcome from elsewhere. Yeah, I could. I could. Cecil that. Baldwin would say this and then just move on with his life. <laughs> Newest residents are from elsewhere. Now the weather. Is, now. is that anything? <laughs> did that scare you? <laughs> did it did it make you go, huh? That was weird. <laughs> How unusual. Elsewhere is the name uh, it's not spelled this way but it's pronounced this way. Elsewhere is the name of the the region where the the Khajiit the cat people are from in um the Elder Scrolls. Nathan's games. right. So, Nathan's not lying. Well. So it, it maybe it's about them. Not lying on the Drafty <laughs> show? <laughs> Nathan's truthing what? right now. Yeah. He's a Nathan truther. Yeah, what if like some cat people from a video game showed up and they tried to give you their wares yeah or or buy your wares yeah or teach you uh train you in in the stealth skill <laughs> what are you talking about just talking about uh elder scrolls stuff okay you know elder scrolls it's a game they made one of 15 years ago <laughs> Just like stopped forever. <laughs> they were like, that's enough of that. <laughs> they used to make them all the time and then they just stopped and made the same one 27 times. And then they released a 30 second video of the title of the next one like five years ago. Ooh, I'm excited for that. You think they're going to make it? I bet they'll make it. When? That's the question. Oh, shit. That's the real question. Yeah, let's get the, no the local, local news <laughs> on that. <laughs> Nocal lewds. Nocal lewds. <laughs> no. <laughs> North California lewds? Yeah. Ew. They call it nocal and socal. <laughs> Men. <laughs> okay, so here's. I really here's, like this fella. Yeah, that's here's, a good fella. Here's a fella. I want to know more about this fella. He looks comfy. He's just a guy. He looks like he's wearing a real comfy jacket. Yeah. He's got sort of like a slick back hairstyle yeah. that I like. Okay, and he's looking at the newest residents. Oh, he's not the newest resident. He's yeah. just he's just here. He's the audience. He's surrogate. one of the current residents. Yeah. Oh, my God. How do I depict this? Uh, I'd recommend drawing it. Yeah. Wow. Thanks, Jacob. <laughs> using, Ideally, really stellar advice you have lines. for me. Lines and shapes. Yeah. Oh and my God. Shading to wow. imply form. I would have never thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you glad you asked? Yeah. <laughs> We're really here to support you. <sighs> Is the newest residence a, a car in perspective? <laughs> <laughs> I did think about it honestly. <laughs> He's just looking at the giant. <laughs> Speaking of perspective, that is wrong. <laughs> it's perspective can't be wrong in a cartoon. Whoa, that's true. And yet, it's always right, no matter okay. what you do. Because you could just be like, that's how it looks in the world of the cartoon. Yeah. yeah. It's stylized. 
That's my style. That's my style. Yeah, my style is I do it wrong. Criticize it. It's my style. Yeah, that's a house. That's a house. <laughs> that's a house. Okay. It could be a barn. Well, yeah, we don't know yet. Much to consider. Yeah. <laughs> it's amazing how much, at least me, yeah. me don't remember what a barn looked like. And you drew the doors like this. Yeah. Aren't I don't they think more that's like right. this? Yeah, I think that's right. But don't they have a window when, thing up there? When it's tiny, can. It, can, it can be whatever you want. I'm just saying you think you know what a barn looks like. I defy you watching this right now to try and draw a barn without reference right now and see how close you get to it, what a barn looks like. It has like, like an extra joint in the ceiling, in the roof. Because house go like this, but barn is like got a flat top so oh it sort of goes a like, joint oh yeah not a joint <laughs> what are you talking an, a, an about? angle an and extra the, yeah, angle like an extra angle but this is a i house. was doing for everyone listening i was doing i was making the shape with my hands just yeah. then yeah. so the, yeah because it didn't make sense it, didn't, it, said. <laughs> it wouldn't auditorially that would not like? have um come across that's, yeah that's a house that's I stairs, just, yeah, and a door. I think a lot, because if you just draw like a house that's just like a rectangle, I don't know, it doesn't it doesn't seem right. <laughs> and I think a lot about how for Dirty Paws, the I designed the house that like the film takes place in, and it's literally just a two-story like studio apartment, <laughs> but it's a house. <laughs> <laughs> And it's so cursed. <laughs> <laughs> but at that point, you had only ever seen a studio apartment. You had only ever seen a dorm room. <laughs> Even smaller than a studio apartment. Whatever. There's like people whose whole job it is to draw a house. Yeah. Yeah. And it ain't mine. Yeah. So you can't expect us to do it good. No. That's not our I don't job. even want to do it good. I'm making a problem for myself yeah. right now. Why did I do this? I don't, I, Why did I decide, yeah, let's just design a house? I think you were hoping that you were doing sort of what I did with the <laughs> owl. What am I doing? Get out of here. I hate you. <laughs> you figured you'd draw something, and by the time you finish drawing the thing, yeah. then you'd have an idea. I was like, when the door isn't front and center, it's like off to the side. Yeah. I, don't, I think I put it way too far <laughs> off to the just, side. Yes, Karina, when the door isn't front and center, it is to the side. That's correct. <laughs> wow, Jacob. You have a bit of attitude today. It's like you were stuck in traffic for an hour before we started recording. <laughs> Breaking news, man stuck in traffic for an hour. <laughs> now he's sassy. Now he's, he's got a little bit of a He's got a little a bit mood. of lip. <laughs> I had a lot of time to build my sassiness. My up. resentment. Yeah. You couldn't take it out on the cars. So you're taking it out on your beloved coworker. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> this is it. This is the house this I did for dirty. <laughs> wow are the newest residents dirty paws oh no <laughs> no they they got um chased away by the town folks their paws were too dirty because they're homophobic <laughs> <laughs> the town folks <laughs> dang yeah, it's, it's a, not a great town yeah That's this tough. town sucks <laughs> they were like yeah yeah you ate you ate that neighbor's cat, <laughs> but we draw the line at home of sexual behavior. Home of sexual. <laughs> Who cares? Why do I care about this house so much? I don't know so why much? you're drawing, like, the detailing the front lights. <laughs> yeah, it's... We're just not going to see. You're just going to finish drawing the house, and we're not going to see the residence. <laughs> That's really... <laughs> Spend like a half hour really detailing stressed. a house. <laughs> well, you, what, you, what you do you finish drawing the house and then you you lasso part of it and open it up and there's like a floppy goblet inside <laughs> well that's what i was thinking I yeah it's like okay some sort of floppy <laughs> floppy <laughs> or or it could be a giant man so far we've established that there are giant men and floppy goblins in yeah. this local news world oh yes yeah. Oh yes! Oh yes! <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> yeah, this is it's a little too big for the house. A little too big. This is a little too big. It's a little cramped. In well, there. he's he's 
to him, this house is a tiny model. Oh, and he's building it. Oh, okay. But it's a little bit bigger yeah. than the than the tiny farm. Well, they don't all build things at the exact same size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're people, Nathan. They're they're just large they're people. They're just large people. Many of them don't build anything at all. <laughs> they just live their lives having <laughs> never built a thing. Yeah. Oh, it's a giant man with a floppy goblin oh, inside. Oh, no. Oh, God. Wow. I didn't realize. Yeah, you thought floppy goblins could only live inside owls, but they can live inside giant men as well. The giant man was not what he seemed. I needed to learn this. I needed to learn this. I needed to learn this. <laughs> I'm from elsewhere, okay? Don't forget it. Don't forget, I'm from elsewhere. <laughs> Don't pay too close attention to the design of my house. <laughs> I'll kill you. <laughs> this is how they look like where I'm from. <laughs> it's normal where I'm from, even if it's weird to you. Yeah, this one window, because I'm not drawing the rest of them. This is normal where I'm from, which is elsewhere. This is standard stuff. Yeah. Everyone would look at my house and say, that's completely normal where I'm from. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Here's the house number. Oh, wait. No, that's not the house number. There we go. <laughs> Negative two. <laughs> it's all coming together. <laughs> Beautiful. Tie it all up with a little bow. This is... <laughs> this is a this is a standard decoration yeah where i'm from which is elsewhere don't worry about it don't worry about <laughs> it don't, don't come back here yeah stop looking at my house and at me and the littler me inside of me I you you cut that out <laughs> Just imagining like a line of home decorations, like in sort of the style of live, laugh, love, and like bless this mess, but it always says this is normal. <laughs> Let us know if you want to see that merch. It's a doormat that says this is normal. Yeah, you get is... inside every room just has a different like stylized word art that all says this is normal. I love that. I would do that in an Airbnb if I had one. <laughs> the normal yeah. Airbnb. <laughs> the sign above the bed, don't worry about it. <laughs> um, here's, here's a tiny tree. Oh. So the other giant has been here too. Well, no, that's just that's just how he did the, the lawn. Yeah. What, you got a problem with my tiny bushes, my little shrubberies? That's how we do it where I'm That's from. That's how we do it. <laughs> to me, this house is small, but I still wanted to make the shrubbery even smaller, proportionate yeah. to the house. God, one more window. <laughs> and I do it by hand. Sometimes I accidentally crush the tree, but I, I have to learn. Yeah, I haven't gotten that feeling yet. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I touch. <laughs> Every time I crush a tree, I'm closer to getting that feeling. <laughs> Nobody's good at something on their first attempt, okay? Yeah. Stop being weird. His hand. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's really, he's really leaning into the the point. I have very bad balance. It's normal where I'm from, which is elsewhere. <laughs> I like to imagine he's standing upright. There's like a basement. Like you go in and it just like drops he's just off. Standing the pit. in a hole. Yeah. <laughs> Shade. Oh, good. Imagine he's once it's finished, he stands in the hole and he's got little finger puppets of people that he like <laughs> moves in front of the windows, <laughs> like Home Alone. Outside. What if he was a giant? What if in Home Alone he was a giant? That's this. That's this. That's this. You don't have to wonder anymore. Yeah. Yeah. He, he's Home Alone confirmed, and he's a giant confirmed. So it must be what you're speaking of. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that happens in Twin Peaks. I think everything happens in Twin Peaks. Yeah. Every every idea. They cover all the bases in that yeah. one. That line is not correct. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Correct lines only, please. What are you laughing about? <laughs> Just sort of the whole the whole thing we've, Just we've got this going. this line, actually. Just sort of. That line's not there. Yeah. Yeah. It's It'll you know, be there eventually, yeah. or not. It doesn't doesn't need to be. Yeah, my lawn uh, uh, grew over onto the sidewalk. 
I don't see why that's a problem. That's what everyone does, where I'm from. Where I'm from, which is elsewhere. <laughs> did I do it? Yeah, you did yeah. it. <laughs> Wow. The new resident is definitely from elsewhere. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't seem to fit in. He doesn't fit his in. Home. <laughs> yeah. And so he got a little article written about him. Good. And I think that's cute. Yeah. More people should write articles about us. Whoa. Because every time we've been mentioned in an article, it makes me laugh. Because uh, yeah, it's bad. <laughs> if you work for a local newspaper where you live, consider writing an article about us. Yeah. yeah. And remember to tell your readers to like and subscribe and comment down below how you would spell Jorb. Yeah, just make sure it's not the way you think. Yeah, because that's not correct. Because that's not correct. It has to be a way you don't think. Yeah. And all for all the Jorbs out there, <laughs> you got a lot of free mentions in this, a lot of free press. Yeah, so you owe us. So you owe us. You got to pay us now. Time to pay the piper over on Patreon. <laughs> yeah. Pony up, Jorb. Pony up, Jorbs. <laughs> I want to see an influx of Jorbs on the yeah. Patreon. On, on our Discord. Oh, yeah. 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 Too many it better Jorbs. be all Jorbs over there yeah. chatting to each other. Yeah. Jorb in the Jorb channel. <laughs> a channel just for the Jorbs. And you can also go look at our merch store, which is normal. It's very normal. And yeah. everything there is just how it should be. Yeah. yeah. Everything we have in there is normal where we're from, which yeah. is elsewhere. Which is elsewhere. Yeah. And we also stream elsewhere. Yeah, which is Twitch. <laughs> yeah. Every time we, we go on Twitch, we say we're from YouTube, which is elsewhere. Yeah. <laughs> and every time we kiss, I swear I can fly. We're, we're sorry. Sorry. Sorry.